All right, welcome to the world headquarters of High Side Chemical, and we're not going to be able to pull a fire permit, but we've got to be able to put copper and brass together. So how would you do it? I'm going to tell you how we'll do it. We're going to do it with Just For Copper. Just For Copper is a bonding product that bonds copper, brass, or aluminum together in any combination without using fire and without using special fittings. Just For Copper has been around for some time, and one of the great things about Just For Copper is it's easy to use. So what we're looking at today is a piece of copper pipe and a brass valve. Now if you tried to bring, um, bronze or solder these two together, um, the problem with that is, particularly with brass valves, is about 400 degrees uh, starts to damage a brass valve. So you have to be very good with uh, the torch not to get it too hot. What we're going to do today is going to be very fast, very easy, and a permanent solution. Um, it will actually create a 1200 PSI bond and is good above 250 degrees. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to take the male part, um, the pipe, and we're going to use 60 grit sandpaper, which comes in the kit. Whenever you receive the uh, Just For Copper package, everything you need to use uh, to create a bond right out of the box is right here, including the 60 grit sandpaper. This 50 gram bottle is good for up to about 200 uses on half inch or three quarter inch pipe. And uh, we're going to use the bottle of a 10 gram that's also available uh, in many locations. And you're probably going to get about 75 to 100 uses out of the 10 gram bottle. So we've uh, sanded in one direction the pipe and a very important note for those of you that are used to soldering, you do not clean the dust off. You leave that on there and that actually helps in the bonding process. We're going to go to the female side of the uh, brass fitting and we're going to make grooves that way as well in the same direction. And again, you're going to leave the dust on there. We're not going to clean that off right now. We have this open bottle of Just For Copper. You're going to apply to the male and the female side. Now the good thing about this is, this is not a glue and it's not an epoxy, it's not sticky, and it's safe for potable water. So you can use your hand, you can use your finger to touch it. We're going to apply a little to the female side as well. And if you're using it in a heating and cooling application and you're worried about the coolant, it's oil soluble. So it will actually dissolve into your oil, uh, refrigerant oil, and will not gum up your refrigerant pro um, unit and your AC unit, your compressor is not going to hurt your compressor at all. Now just that fast, the bonding process has already began. Um, the copper and brass are bonding together right now. In 20 seconds, you're going to be able to continue working. In 20 minutes, you're going to have about a 700 PSI bond. In about two hours, you'll have about a 1200 PSI bond. Uh, Just for Copper is amazingly efficient. Um, like I said, a bottle goes a long, long way. It's 100 applications, and if you compare that to silver solder, um, the cost effectiveness of Just for Copper is off the charts, about 300%. And just like that, we have created a bond between copper and brass without using fire. We didn't pull a fire permit, uh, and it's a consistent uh, joint as well. Now, right now, you can grab it and try to twist a little bit. That fit is uh, good enough to continue working at this time. Again, just for copper. Mm -hmm.